Department of Defense high school students from around the Pacific gathered on Okinawa to express themselves through art at the Far East Creative Expressions. Over three days, they got an opportunity to explore various art forms in depth and hone their skills. Well, I've been doing art since I was a little kid, and it's just something I've always loved my entire life. So, I'm, this is actually my, one of my first times acrylic painting. So it was pretty interesting to have to do that. I know it kind of opened me up to new ways of like working with things, and with the minor I did in printmaking, I learned new techniques that I had never even like thought of, you know? Being able to have this opportunity, it's really nice. A lot of students in the States and in other schools on the island where I'm from, Guam, they don't get these opportunities to collaborate with other people that are their age. Curators from the Smithsonian Museum of Art in Washington, D.C. also talked to the students about art careers and taught them how to present and care for their art. I'm really excited to work with them. I think that they've been really well prepared for this program, being able to sort of take a step back from an artwork and, and talk about why the artist might have used specific colors or lines and that sort of thing. I think it's really important for the students because it's bridging what they're learning in school and what they're obviously very passionate about with the art, um, but bridging that into more of a real world concept. The week ended with an art show at the Kafu Resort. It was open to the public and the students got to celebrate their creativity. Marine Corporal Nate Carberry, Ona Village, Okinawa.